Hey, it's Sam from Kibble Equipment. Now I'm standing here in front of an 8RX 410. Now this may look like every other 8RX that you've ever seen, but this one in particular has one piece of mechanical technological innovation that's probably as important as anything that's come out on a John Deere tractor in the last 20 years, the EVT. Now, if you're not sure what EVT stands for, you're probably not alone on that one. It's actually a form of our IVT, or infinitely variable transmission, that's been a stepless transmission option available for 8Rs, 7Rs, and 6Rs for several years. What makes the EVT really special is that instead of being powered hydrostatically by hydro motors, it's powered by electric generators. Now, this unlocks a lot of possibilities for the future of tractors and John Deere. Now the first thing you'll notice when you start driving a tractor with an EVT transmission is the fact that there's no noise really coming from the transmission. Now the transmission's generally right below the cab, so it is a source of a pretty significant amount of noise normally. And when you have a hydro-powered IVT, when you hear those hydros spool up is when you start moving that IVT handle forward, you don't have any of that noise with the EVT transmission. Now, is that the biggest selling point uh, for an EVT transmission? Probably not, but it is a really significant thing you'll notice when you get in the cab. Now, from out of year 2023, the EVT transmission was available just on the 8R410 series tractors like this 8RX410, which traditionally didn't have an option for an IVT. So it's important to note that they didn't just take the IVT transmission itself and put electric motors on it. The whole transmission itself was updated and beefed up for higher horsepower applications like the 410 right here. All right, so one of the most important features of this EVT transmission is actually a feature that really doesn't have any current practical use. Now it sounds ridiculous, but hang with me. Because the EVT has these two electric motors, one of them is always spinning at a constant rate and actually has the ability to offboard some of its power out the back of the tractor. And by some of its power, I mean 100 kilowatts. That's a lot of power that we can put out the back of this tractor. Now. The current issue is that there are no implements that can shake hands with that power and utilize it. Now John Deere hasn't made any announcements on products that would utilize this power offboarding, but just think for yourself about an implement that John Deere could make that could utilize power out the back of the tractor from a plug versus its current mode of power generation. So with major reductions in maintenance and diagnostics, major increases in reliability, in efficiency, technology. This is the John Deere tractor powertrain of the future now. Take video by the highway. It's a great idea, Sam. <laughs>